Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. Um, let's jump into some FTL. I feel like it's been a little bit since we've done any FTL runs, and um, I'd like to see how the, the new mic works with the uh, audio balance here. So, uh, let's see. We think we have a Kestrel A win, NGA win, Sultan A win. I don't think we've done Fed Cruiser or any of the other ships. Um, what do we want to do? Let's do... Do we want to do Stealth A? Let's do Rock A. Rock A is kind of a... It's a little bit harder to get a good start with because you're dependent on missiles. So if you don't find a alternative weapon early on, you're kind of SOL, but, um, yeah, let's go ahead and start with the Rock A. Um, we're going to play on hard with Advanced Edition on, and let's get into it. Um, so let's get these guys powered up, and, yeah. Um, I don't think we need to whip anybody. We're all good there. Okay, well, that's an easy decision on where to jump to. Okay, we will reject that. And these are the sorts of fights you want to see. Um, let's see here. One, two, three, four. Does he have eight? One, two, three. as well. We're going to have to use three missiles no matter what, so um, two missiles is good, but let's take the, let's get greedy and take the scrap. Or take the uh, better reward for the uh, ship kill. We got our two missiles anyways. Uh, okay, well, so luckily we have the rock plating to sell. Um, so hopefully we can don't even have anything that we want here. Um, that's sort of unfortunate. Um, we're going to go ahead and sell rock plating because it's not really worth it. Um, we really don't even have enough money to buy anything besides crew, so I think that's kind of a wasted store, but at least we got to sell our rock plating. One, two. Um, if we had long range scanners, I might consider buying um, level 2 piloting to see if we could get that um, Ion Storm event in one of these nebulas, but we don't, so I'm just going to take these normal jumps. Okay, ship fight. Uh, we have a. We're not really worried about boarding crew. Um, since we have a bunch of rockmen. We are a little bit worried when they decide to go into our um, shields. I'm going to see if I can vent him out in time. I don't think I can, but let's turn off oxygen. Okay. And then we can go ahead and send you up. Thank you. So, just as long as this whole missile connects, should be good. Yeah, okay, cool. Not bad. And it, it's always nice to see uh, some missiles in the rewards. Because um, right now, I think we've only technically lost two missiles from the amount that we started with. So, that is not bad at all. Let's get oxygen powered back up. like seeing all these beacons around the exit because um, you don't really have to optimize your route too much. You can sort of just 
jump around the back and um, whatever you you need to leave, just jump to the exit immediately. Uh, we're probably not going to need those um, drone parts until we actually have a system that can use them. So let's jump here just to see as many beacons as we can. Um, okay, okay, okay. Um, our quest is back up there. Three, four, five. I think we get five jumps. Two, three, four, five. I think we can take this distress and then just jump straight up. Um, just, whew, that was actually very good. Um, well, except for the fact that we're going to take um, fire damage. Oh, no, the fire went out. I don't know how the fire went out. Maybe it was because the oxygen was so low in there. Uh, but I'm not going to look a gift horse in the mouth. So we essentially took one damage for like, what was it, 20 scrap and five fuel or something like that. That's, uh, that's a trade I'll take any day of the week. So um, uh, we have another distress beacon. Let's wait for him to get back to weapons and then we'll go ahead and jump. Okay. Okay, we've got the chain ion, which is um, pretty much worthless to us, um, but it's a start. So one, two, three. Okay, it's something to sell. We're honestly good on missiles, so I'm not super concerned yet about um, not finding missile al alternatives, but. Um, once we start getting down to like around like 15 to 10 missiles, then I'll start getting a little bit more worried. But let's go ahead and see if we can get their weapons offline real quick. The nice thing is the Artemis charge is pretty fast. So yeah, it actually can beat out that mini beam. And since he doesn't have any systemless rooms, we're just going to alternate with our missiles until we can get down his evasion. Okay, and then we'll focus on again because we're not you know actually let's do that and then we'll do this okay we have a breach there I don't think there's any way for us to get a crew kill so I'm just gonna take them out uh, a good amount of fuel and a good amount of scrap so I don't know if we actually get three jumps here. Uh, let's try it. I don't think we do, but... Okay, nothing. It's going to be really close. Uh, let's just greet it and see. Find the remains of the ship. It seems to have severe external damage, but you cannot pinpoint a cause. The majority of its cargo seems intact. Um, I think we want to just take the cargo for ourselves. Yeah, we'll just do that. Okay, cool. Um, oh, and we uh, we do actually get a the exit. I don't know. I think taking it. I think essentially they're both sort of the same. Um, I think, though, if you take the cargo right there, there's a chance of getting a weapon. Um, I think, but... Oh, cool, okay. We have a civilian ship, so that's good. Uh, potential double reward here. Let's take their weapons offline and then queue up a whole missile. Okay, that's not good. this, though, because I want to. Oh, shoot. Okay. I was hoping, or I was 
afraid that was going to happen. Alright, we need to get that double laser offline again. Okay, and then... Just do that, and then we'll get this charged up. That's unfortunate. I'm gonna see if we can take out their piloting before we hit them with the whole missile. So now, so you can sort of see why um, having a missile ship is so bad. It's very easy for things to go south if you just whip a couple of shots. Um, awesome. So we got a Angie crew member, which is great for. Uh, blue events, or blue options, I mean. Um, I think Rock, I think NG and then Rock may be second. Um, NG have the most blue options, and I think Rock have the second most blue options, so um, love to see at least one of each on a ship, especially so early on. And let's go ahead and assign everybody to their spots, and we'll get out of here. I'm a little bit concerned about having only 17 missiles, but um, hopefully we can get a... I see a bunch of green sectors, so that's always good. Um, hopefully we can get a shop early on in this rebel sector, so... Um, to disconnect. This is a... We might actually just take these nebula jumps, just because we're great on fuel, so... And if they're dead jumps, they're dead jumps. I don't really care too much. Okay, cool. We got a ship fight out of that. Um, except they have a defense drone. And they took out our shields. Okay, so that's not good. Okay. We don't really care about attacking at this point. We're just going to have to run, so... We're just hoping that they don't uh, bomb our engines or bomb our piloting. Okay, so that's also not what we wanted to see. Um, but at least we have an NG there, so that's always good. Okay, that's also not what we wanted to see. Um, I guess we can go... Ahead. Well... By the time he fights his way out of that, out of shields, it's not even going to matter. So, okay. So that's the other bad thing about um, the Rock A is that you're completely defenseless against ships that have... Uh, yeah, we'll do that. That's a ton of fuel. You're completely defenseless against ships that um, have a defense drone. Okay, there's no reason for us to jump there, because if, even if this is a store, we're not going to jump to it. So let's jump here. We're really looking for a uh, store. I, I'd really like to get level 2 shields, um, but until we get a weapon, um, something to start replacing these missiles, I'm going to try and hold on to as much scrap as I can. Okay, cool. see if we can take these guys out with one more hull missile. Okay, they definitely have an NG on their ship. Or maybe even a system repair drone. So, okay, cool. Okay, we need, we desperately need to find a store here, so I want to check jumps that give us the most beacons that we can see. Thing. Okay, there's our store. Do you want to greed and take another jump before we go there? Three, four, four, five, six, seven, maybe. 
yeah, let's go ahead and take this jump. Okay, don't like seeing that, but luckily we... I think we'll be okay if we target their piloting first. Just as long as they're... Okay, that's not what we wanted to see. Okay. We're taking some damage here, but I really don't care. We really need to try and make sure that we... I'm going to take this shot with the hull missile. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Um, wow, okay. Wow, he dodged three missiles in a row. So we just wasted a ton of missiles and then had the... Man, just the luck on that. We shot his drone, his combat drone, with our hull missile that should have taken him out. And then he dodged three missiles in a row after that. That's amazing. That's alright, we still have a lot of scrap. Um, hopefully we can... And of course they don't have any weapons, so... Um... chain ion what is this charge time on here I don't actually know 14 seconds is oh, pretty bad um, one so it starts at one two so you need essentially three three shots before you can take down level two shields. That's not so good. Um, I was thinking maybe we could buy drone control and then buy a combat one, but I don't think that's going to be realistic. Um, I think we're just going to have to... I think we buy m these missiles. I think we sell this. I don't see any circumstance where we use the chain ion. So I'm going to just go ahead and sell that now. And I think what we do is focus on getting ourselves to level 2 shields. And the chances of us finding another store here. I don't think there. I think there's actually only one store in a rebel sector we'll boost our evasion a little bit more and um, we'll just keep on looking for a uh, um, another way to get a weapon three is that connected to anything okay let's jump here let's just try and maximize our jumps before we hit our exit beacon okay If we can take this guy out with just hull missiles, I'd like to do that just to save some ammo. I think we can, just as long as this these shots connect. I'm a little afraid he's going to dodge this, but okay, he didn't. Good. Okay. Triple dodge. Wow, nice guys. Got some training too, so. Oh, awesome. Okay. So we had a reversal of luck on the. So we actually only lost one missile from that fight, so that's pretty good. Um, we had a reversal of luck in terms of our uh, dodging and hit chances there, so that's always good. 
Let's get everybody back to their positions and keep going. Still a little bit nervous about our chances going forward. Uh, there's a laser charger mark too. Um, which is not, not bad. Um, now we can put get online immediately. Um, yeah, that's pretty good. Um, do we want to? Potentially keep the Artemis charged up too. Um, maybe not now. I think we're okay for the time being. Um, yeah, I think we're okay for now. One, one, two, three. Those don't connect, do they? One, three, four. I think we'll. I think we're. I think we're gonna miss out on a jump here, but. I'm happy that we got a weapon, so um, we definitely want to do that. Okay, so they did doors, which doesn't really matter. And that is a heavy ion, so we don't really care about it. Um, let's do this. take our time here because that heavy ion should not have um, oh might be important to get our oxygen back online This isn't the most ideal setup, um, but having a at least having four shots at a time is serviceable, at least for the, the first two sectors. Um, things might get a little bit more hairy as we get, get a little bit more advanced, uh, but for now, I mean, I'm thankful to get anything besides these missile launchers. What do we get here? Nothing. Trust Beacon. Let's go check it out. Um, let's just shield. Okay. A little bit of free scrap is always good. Okay. Just auto fire on their piloting. Okay. And then let's go ahead and just hit their engines too. These weapons shouldn't technically be able to deal any damage to us, so wow. So he's level three engines at least. Awesome. Nice. Okay. A little bit of scrap is never a bad thing. Let's see what we get at our exit beacon. Um, we don't have any use for these now, so I'll just go ahead and sell them. Um, yeah, we missed out on one jump, but that's okay. We have NG Controlled and NG Homeworlds. Um, honestly... I'd almost want to take NG Controlled over NG Homeworlds because the NG uh, Homeworlds quest is actually just uh, 
one I know I think one of the jumps can actually just be like an empty jump that doesn't really give you anything but we'll take this because it gives us two green options afterwards so but you love to see engine sex sectors um, just because this is a great chance to um, get some stores but more importantly um, um, get just resources from Oh, I was hoping for a, uh, a fight there. That's all right. Um, okay. So, the issue is that these stores are on the exact opposite sides of the map. Okay. So, what we could actually do is... One, two, three, four, five, six... We could actually jump, head down here, head up, and then jump to the exit after we visit that store. Because um, I do actually kind of want to visit both, but I think we'll, I think we'll go ahead and do that. Um, yeah, let's do that. Uh, that's a little intimidating. Um, let's go ahead and charge up as much as we can here. And see if we can get that halberd beam offline. Okay. Okay, well, we got the laser offline, so that's good. Yeah, let's turn, turn off auto fire. And we're safe for now. Um, but this is one of those reasons why we, we might want to have an Artemis online as a backup. Um, just in case. Because Artemis is actually a really good starting weapon. But right now we're, we're okay. He can't break through our shields with that halberd beam by itself. So let's see if we can get if we can get his shields offline. Um, then we're just good to go. They're not gonna let us. I'm almost about ready to switch to missiles here. If this volley doesn't take down their at least one level of their shields, I'm going to switch to missiles. Okay, there we go. I just I don't want to take any damage from that halberd beam, so we're gonna see if we can get at least that laser offline. Exactly what I didn't want to see. It's not a huge amount of damage, but the problem with the Rock A is against beam weapons, you're kind of prone to take a lot of damage because um, you have all these tiny little rooms together, so the computer will just randomly draw a line across the uh, your ship and, like, there you could just end up taking like if we didn't have shields we could have taken two four six eight like eight points of damage from that halberd beam so just pays to be careful about that sort of stuff i think we actually ng sector is one of the few sectors where it's more beneficial to take empty jumps than it is to take ship fights um, because you have a better chance of getting Uh, just random re rewards like that. Do we want to... One, two, three, four. Four, five. Six. One, two, three, five. We maybe get five jumps. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Seven, eight, maybe. I think we need to jump to this beacon. I think we're either going. Hmm. I don't. Uh, I'm gonna click this, but I don't think that this does anything. Um. Yeah. And we'll give them the 15 missiles because we don't. 
we're going to have two stores coming up, so I would prefer to get as much of a reward as we can from these missiles. So, um, a nice repair and uh, uh, upgrade to the reactor is not bad. Um, and then we'll go ahead and jump to this store and see what we've got. And let's keep our fingers crossed and hope that we get nothing that's actually useful. Um, we're going to sell that. We sold all our missiles, so our missile launchers aren't worth it anymore. I'm going to buy hacking. And that is it. We'll save the rest of the money for the next store, but I think hacking is 100% worth it. Um, and I think I will just try my hardest to save that money. Do we get three jumps here? One, three. I think we do. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Two, three. Yeah. So we can hit both these stores. Um, we will side with the fugitive here. He could betray us, but I would not mind getting a Mantis crew member. And we did, and he's already leveled in fighting, so that's awesome. Um, I don't like the fact that they have a halberd beam. Um, okay. Why aren't you in shields? And I'll have you work sensors. I think we can go ahead. Let's go ahead and sneak this through to disable um, drone control um, because that's a defense too. So, no, it, you know, let's do shields actually. They hit it. Let's try one more time. I don't think I'm going to be able to get it through, but... Oh, well, that's not good. Okay. 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 We got the defense two offline. There's a good chance we're going to be running from this fight um, because they have an NG repairing. This is just a really strong setup no matter what. And I don't want to take too much damage here. I don't think there's any way that we can get through two shields and a defense too with the setup that we have currently. So we're just going to get out of here. We got a Mantis crew member for that. So there's a free drone. Go ahead and just lick our wounds and get everything healed up and we still have a ton of scrap for any potential weapons that this next uh, store might have so we're in really good position here just need to see some weapons to supplement this uh, uh, charge mark 2 charge legion mark 2 so okay, let's get everybody back to your positions and let's go ahead and save positions Okay. Okay. Don't really care about a mantis. Let's see where he goes. Hacking. That might be a good idea to actually have our weapon online. Um, besides that bomb, we're not really scared of this ship at all. Just as long as it doesn't hit our shields or our weapons. Are you going to win that fight? I think so. How much health do you have? Oh no, you're not going to win that fight. Let's get you out of there and have you finish the job. I don't know how you didn't... Okay, well that's unfortunate. I don't know, he already has level 1 
fighting. I was hoping he should have been able to take that guy, but... Alright, let's just take these shields down. Okay, and then take their weapons. I said take their weapons out. Um, I said take their weapons out. Jesus. not getting it right this time. Um, I'll take your piloting out. I want the Mantis to get this kill, so I just want that guy to tank for long enough to make sure that he gets that kill. And honestly, we'll just send you guys over here. We can just auto-fire at this point. Oxygen back on. Get you healed up all the way. And we should be good. Alright, nice. Okay. Wow. Um, that's not a very common occurrence unless you're like uh, getting like a homeworld uh, quest reward. I don't think I've ever actually seen that, where you get a uh, crew member and a uh, drone or weapon reward, so... I mean, I'm not I'm not complaining. Definitely not complaining. Um, welcome aboard. You can be on doors now, so... Nice, we got a nice little crew going here. Um, and no filthy humans, so that's always positive. And let's go check out this store now. So... Any weapons. Um, I'm not really super keen on what we're seeing here, but I, I think we should probably take the whole laser mark too. I'm not super keen on it, but just anything to supplement our damage is not a bad idea. And that, honestly, that's six damage that you can be potentially doing to a shield or a, a ship just as long as you have um, a systemless room on it. It's just whether or not. Can we actually get that up and running ASAP? I don't know. Let's see here. One, two, three. We can. I guess we'll do it. I'm not super thrilled to be doing that, but let's buy it, and we're good for now, so I'm not going to try and get it online immediately. Um, we'll take a couple more jumps and then see if we can get it online. Um, does that connect? Okay, let's take this empty jump. Okay, nothing. And we'll take this ship jump, and then we'll head to the exit. I see a burst laser mark to let's counter um, oh a burst laser mark three what I do see though is a uh, potential crew kill here We might be running here. This is a really strong ship. And we're not getting our dodges that we really need. Um, if we can 
get any of these shots through. Okay, good. That's what I wanted to see. And honestly, we could still get a crew kill here. I don't want you to die. So they don't have... They have limited evasion now. We know that there's only a... Uh, Zoltan uh, repairing this weapon. So we're going to try our hardest to see if we can actually kill this guy. repaired up ASAP. I want you to go there. <laughs> okay, got it repaired. It's not what I wanted to see. Okay, cool. I think we can still do this. I need... Okay. We got another level on weapons, so that's good. Um, so that'll help with our charge times. Man, are you kidding? Eventually this guy's got to run out of bombs. Let's have you move back and help with repairs. It looks like they're out of missiles. Okay, I think we've got him, depending on what his health is. 40. We might not have enough to kill him, but he can't deal any more damage to us, so... Oh, great. They, they actually resisted, so... Um, so we should be able to get another point of damage on him. We should be able to kill this guy and get the crew kill. Nice. I don't know if it was really worth it or not, but... Um, man, that was just a stupidly strong ship for some reason. Not, not stupidly strong, but... Um, the fact that they had at least a 5-weapon system... Um, level 5-weapon level system is... This early on is pretty ridiculous. Let's take this jump and then we'll maybe consider upgrading, getting this hull laser 2 online. Um, okay. Nothing. Um, so I'm kind of glad that we took that middle jump. Um, because honestly, I just don't. Zoltan sectors are just sort of a nightmare to deal with. Um, definitely take the civilian sector. Let's get everybody repaired or healed up and let's figure out what we want to do here. We don't have any stores immediately so we might want to consider getting our hull laser online. Let's get you boys out. Get you guys in. Can we do that? One, two, three. Almost. I mean, we can. Um, I want you indoors. Close all doors. I think I actually do want to do that. It's a little bit early to be doing that in the sector um, but I just I have a sneaking suspicion that we're gonna get like a hard ship fight right after we jump from here so 
How long does it take you to charge again? 14 seconds? 15 seconds, so. So technically these are on the same cycle. Um, okay, let's jump here. A burst laser mark two and a glaive beam. That is ridiculous. to um, yeah we're gonna take that to the face no matter what but we could do this okay that's something That honestly wasn't wasn't all that bad. I I knew we were gonna take at least one glaive beam. Um, okay. Okay, so we didn't get our scrap reward, so that kind of stinks. But um, or our two rewards, but that's all right. Um. Let's go ahead and take this jump. Um, okay, a little bit of scrap. We don't have a fire beam or anything, so I don't really care about hitting this quest marker. Um, how does this sector connect? Okay. It might make sense for us to Let's jump over here. We'll hang out on the top of the sector and then hook back down. Okay, empty sector. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, maybe. Check out this distress beacon. Um. I was, oh, we lost our weapons guy. I don't like seeing that. I was willing to risk it just because um, I'm just super sad that it was our weapons guy that got lost. Um, but I think we're, I think we're all right. I'm, I'm not super fussed about losing a crew member. Um, we're gonna attack the pirate even though, man, this is a strong ship too the heck is up with all these strong ships? Um, we're still going to attack them. We need to get hacking online. But what we're going to do is actually... I'm going to wait for three to do. And that. And then this. Don't really care about sensors. Two. Okay. Okay, nice. So we got a breach on. Th so that's a nice thing about the hull lasers. It does have a good, pretty good chance of breaching.
Uh, no. We're going to reject, and we'll take that free crew kill. Okay. There's another church, too. Oh, lord. Um... You know, I don't think we want any of this. Um... I think we just need to get our hacking online, to be completely honest with you. Uh, it's nice to have the options, but... Mind control would be nice, but I don't think that... I don't think it helps us all that much. Let's do... Let's get level 2 hacking. And let's do let's fight those and that and I think we're I think we're good um, and let's get you guys healed up guy, you're our sensors guy, you're our engines guy, right? Engines piloting. Um, yeah. These are... Oh, of course there's another store right there. I don't think that it would have changed anything about what we did, um, honestly. Uh, because this weapon system, especially with hacking level 2, is pretty good. So, I think we will just... Two, three, four, five. Go ahead and keep on moving on. I'm going to skip that store. Or am I? Um, is it worth us going back to sell this combat too? Um, I don't think so. Well, you know what, we will. Just for fun, we'll see what's here. Not anything good. Um, but we will go ahead and sell that for now. And... Just do that, just to make things easier. What's this? I, don't, I think this is the Mantis camp. Yeah, that was just an empty jump, that's all right. Okay, not super fussed about this weapon system. Oh. Except that's an Iron Blast Mark II. Still not super fussed about it. Especially if, yeah. Okay, let's do that. And that. Okay, we got a breach in there too, so that's good start focusing down at ship's going to burn down. Okay. We do need to worry about trying to get shields to level 3, though. Things are going to start getting hairy here in a second. Especially since we lost our weapons guy. How, we're, how are you progressing? Not great. Let's go ahead and just jump to this exit. I think we actually will do that. Um, and we'll 
I'll take this civilian controlled sector. All right, well, we're halfway through our run, so I think I'll go ahead and call it day now and uh, take a break and we will come back and pick up where we left off later. So thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys later.